memory we all have from Brazil is when uh, you won the championship for Scuderia Ferrari in uh, 2007. Uh, what's your fondest memory of that race? Well, obviously the, uh, the end result, winning the championship and the team winning the team championship. So, you know, that, uh, that was the, uh, the important thing that we went there to try to achieve and we managed to achieve. So. There's a story about uh, when you uh, got out of the car at the end of the race that uh, you took off the helmet and balaclava and your eyes uh, were wet. Uh, were you getting emotional in that moment? Well, I don't remember. Uh, could be, maybe not, maybe yes, but I don't you know. Obviously, it was a hard fight uh, year, long year, so it was, uh, was nice to nice to end the year with the win and plus winning the championship so I think for, for everybody it was a quite uh, uh, kind of uh, relief. Uh, technically speaking it's a, a very uh, old, old generation track with a number of different corners. Uh, which one do you like best? Is it the S to Senna or maybe the Junction at the end? Or? Um, I think the old circuit is nice, it's, uh, especially last year they resurfaced and uh, had a very good grip on the circuit, so made it even more more nice to drive. And uh, you know, it's it's not very long circuit, uh, it's not very long lap, so um, I don't think there's a one place. It's the overall the, the layout, and because it's such a short lap that it it feels only like a few corners uh, in uh, comparing to Spa or something. So. Um, it's just a good place, Brazil now with a new, new, new surface. Uh, it's said to be a tricky uh, track uh, for, for setting up the car because you never know where you end up, like uh, understeering or oversteering. Uh, so, what would you ideally recommend? Well, you have to go by your own feeling and hopefully get it right. But uh, you know, there's uh, um, not the easiest place, but uh, you know, once you get it right, it's, it's a, a good, uh, good fun to try.